Hey guys, welcome to new video, 39 Dusha here and today video I'm gonna try to recover not to refine, only to recover rhodium, ruthenium and uh, maybe some tungsten uh, from the reed relays so uh, here in this little box I have pretty nice amount of the already opened big and small reed relays and uh, here I got some whole reed relays, no copper there. So, uh, depends of the manufacturing. Reed relays is uh, stainless steel, but on the touch point, they got some uh, rhodium, most of the way rhodium, some ruthenium, you see on the middle, of that on the contact point that plating this is the rhodium maybe ruthenium or the rare case is a tungsten tungsten is the worst because uh, it's not worth too much but rhodium specially worth and the ruthenium is not too bad see that contact point so the glass the glass tube is a full of some gas so when you break that break that outside not in the close area so here I got I don't know how much weight we will see later okay more one in there okay empty okay here I got already open it read relays and uh, if you see Let's try to turn off the light. E no. Much better with the light. You see on the top, on the top of contact that you got some reddish shiny plating and that supposed to be a rhodium. Sometime is ruthenium. Maybe a tungsten, but tungsten is not very shiny so uh, here I got some big one some small one the small one have some gold plating on the steel but most of the contact point you see that we got some other metal so here this already separate from the glass but here I need to separate this big one you see on the picture how it's look uh, the two relay in just one copper coil. So this is just a normal one. You see one contact point But I got an other one. You see Two piece of metal and one on the other side and we got uh, two uh, stainless steel roads in there and uh, One it's just a normal you see there but the other one let's try to zoom that the other one have a wire round self you see that and uh, they got some uh, other plate on it on the on the contact point so this maybe it's rhodium pure rhodium maybe it's rhodium plated or maybe it's uh, even a platinum I think I got one there yeah this is the one so you see this little plate this little plate is maybe a platinum but I suppose to be a rhodium definitely we, we will see on the end okay so what I'm gonna do I will just recover that and uh, I need to test that I will not test that in this video I will test that with the x-ray gun uh, when I go to main city to test some gold for selling I will just bring that little bead if I stress to melt that first I need to break that outside and put that pull that out okay we got even one 
green one. The green one most of the time have gold plating on the on the whole uh, stainless steel. And in the middle you see the rhodium plating, okay?
okay guys so you see what I do I just add uh, copper in the powder form until I saturate solution until anything more it's dissolved so right now I got excess of that copper you see in this jar so what I'm gonna do right now no more no more uh, acid active acid inside no more hydrochloric acid active inside no more nitric acid active inside so right now when I add when I add boiling hydrochloric acid only that stuff will only dissolve this uh, copper so probably from all that slug I should left only with the black powder and that pow black powder should be gold rhodium ruthenium or something else but it should be a noble metal okay so let's boil some alcoholic acid and add it in this jar okay Okay guys, so this is our solution, so I'll just uh, filter that and I need to refine that residue, okay? So let's filter that. Okay guys. So I burn that powder right you see right over there there it's a powder and this is just a burn paper and like you see in my uh, gold recovery videos that paper is not weight too much so it's much easier for me to just keep that in filter and burn that together after that melt that together then just separate a filter so here is our cemented powder this is this is the residue which uh, I uh, cemented from that solution and this is supposed to be a rhodium and this is just burn papers okay let's see what we have here well we got some weight yeah like you see 0 0.3 gram black powder so uh, this definitely have some weight here like I said I'm not sure what is this is this a rhodium or ruthenium or tungsten the mostly they use rhodium on the read relays but sometimes very rare they use ruthenium, ruthenium or tungsten for now i'm gonna just keep that and uh, i will melt that later be because the rhodium is very heavy to melt so uh, with a normal torch so uh, right now i will just keep that yeah, yeah not bad not bad from very solid amount of free relay i got 0 0.3 gram possible possibly rhodium yeah okay so this go to pile i hope that you like this uh, procedure um, once again this is not a video how you supposed to do that this is a video how i do that and i just want to show you how i collect uh, rhodium from that read relay so uh, i hope you like my way and uh, this is enough for today we will see you in the next video until that say scrap may gold have fun friend cheers